Mistakes made and shortcuts taken by mechanics. News 13 is investigating the unsafe fixes happening in body shops across the state. Yeah, that's because anybody can open a repair shop in North Carolina. They do not have to be licensed. News 13's Jennifer Emmerich here with information every car owner needs to see. Jennifer. It only takes one garage cutting corners to put any one of us on the road at risk. Being an informed consumer and knowing what to look for is your best defense. I get emotional about this. The marks on this car are a risk to every driver. This muffler is actually shoved back and touching the plastic splash shield. Well, that's a fire hazard. And as a father, that infuriates me. That really ticks me off. And I like use of choice words, but I won't. As an expert witness in mechanics, Ryan Allen understands the danger better than most. So I'm sitting in court because I think about my kids and what would I do if it was my kids. But it's got a buckle right here where the seat belt is and right where the airbag is. And who sits right in that seat? That's where my son sits. My daughter sits on the other side. Of mechanics were supposed to replace the bumper reinforcement. Well, it helps absorb it. And, and the muffler. So had we not done an inspection on this vehicle, all you would have seen is that real pretty plastic cover on the bumper and the consumer would never have known. That despite the insurance company that should be straight up and down. Paying for the new parts. And you can see it's still damaged. It was not replaced and that is a huge safety issue. A simple experiment shows why. Take an aluminum can. Whole, it can hold a lot of weight before it collapses. But if the can is compromised with a simple dent, even a little weight can compromise the integrity, causing it to collapse easier. Cars are engineered to collapse and crumple in very specific ways for your family's safety. The damage traveled in a good foot and a half on this frame rail, and nothing was done to correct it. There you go. If somebody hits this frame rail just right, coming from behind, how far is the damage going to travel now? Putting those riding in the car at risk. But mechanics also call it fraud. That's the body shop stealing those parts. That's, that's exactly what they did. They stole from the insurance company. They stole from the owner here. I started a campaign seven years ago to get shop licensed. You have to be licensed to get your hair braid, to braid hair. Um, and, and I've talked to a House of Representatives, senators, and a car can go down the road at 150, like this car, 150, 160 miles an hour, and you or myself tomorrow, with no expertise whatsoever, you could open a body shop tomorrow. But in North Carolina, it's become a pass the buck situation. Most of them want to put it off on the Department of Insurance. The Department of Insurance wants to put it off on the Attorney General's office. News 13 ran into the same when I reached out to the Attorney General's office, who sent us to the Department of Insurance. Commissioner Wayne Goodwin put it back on the legislature. Based upon my conversations with lawmakers over the last several years, there has not been a stomach by the legislative branch to create a new license for uh, body shops. So you have to be uh, your own advocate. Frame rail right here is buckled. Ask to see the parts your mechanic replaced and take a close look at the seams between panels. They should be even. Those are telltale signs that something might not be wrong with the, the um, alignment of the body panel. It could mean that you have unibody damage or frame. Several of the lawmakers I checked with say the issue has just never been pushed in the legislature. The week I spoke with Pack Brothers Collision Center, they had nine attorneys that had reached out to them to prove shops had engaged in unfair and deceptive trade practices as a result of those unsafe repairs. And Jennifer, recently there's been some legal action, right, on this front? That's right. Sometimes it can be a customer's only recourse mm -hmm. to take legal action. In fact, North Carolina just had its largest judgment against an auto body shop and insurers on a land Land Rover that should have been totaled. They made the repairs to it. A jury found otherwise. Listening to experts like the ones we talked to in our story. So know what's happening with your car. Yeah. That's right. Do your due diligence. Absolutely. All right. Thank you, Jennifer.